作品はノンリニアに複数の、まあ、2つ大きく分けて2つだと思うんですけど、えー、複数の時代の場面が複雑に構成されていました、えー、現在の映画の形はある程度最初から頭に,頭にあったものなのでしょうかそうですね。I think the, the idea that, that came when I was talking to my editor is like we try to、um, capture the essence of time. What is the time? And、um, in, in the normal sense, we understand time as a, a reference point of past, present, and future, right? But I think in the film, time is e n d we, we only associate with time when, the time, when, when we enter the death. And the whole world is e n d after we die. The time is finished after we die. I think that's why the film starts with death and e n d with death. So we can realize that the time had. Its meaning just before we die, and then we're coming back to life after the beginning of the film, and then we end the film with another death, which is, you know, going another life and another meaning of times. Thank you very much. So, this is a lot of people who are in the world. I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you about the fact that I'm going to tell you ものとしてあの私たちは把握の感じていますけれども、自分にとってはそのあの時間にというものはその終わりがあると思っているんですね。で、例えばその死に入った時に、そして世界が終わった時にその時間というのが一旦終わる。だからこそこの映画は死から始まり死に終わるんですね。で、そうすることによってその時間の意味が何なのかということが死ぬ前にそのわかるし、そしてまた新しくそのあのまあこれは冒頭になります。死から始まるということは新しくその,あの時間の,その意味というものをそこから知ることができるあのそういうまあ時が始まるというそういうあの構成になっています